came in a bit oh, late worry, because then I next didn't week have we'll, light. By next week, uh, you have light. You, you have been giving us a special timetable? Yeah, next week. You have a timetable? No. Or you have uh, a schedule? The, the board... The, the board chairman of the ECG says next week. I see. Um, so now, having said that, I think that it is also very important to draw attention to something that is happening in the country. And I'm referring to the National House of Chiefs. The National House of Chiefs. Mm. You see, when they do it to somebody and you don't talk, okay, and you don't comment about it, and you don't say anything about it, mind you, as it gradually progresses or inches, most likely it will get to you. And I want every chief, if you are a chief, hmm, listening to me this morning, this message is directed at you. Okay. The chieftaincy institution is way older than this system of governance that we are practicing. Okay? It is way older. The chieftaincy institution has existed way before the white man came to introduce us to this modern systems of governance. And our chiefs have always been revered. Anything at all you see a chief doing has significance and meaning to it. Okay? When a chief is, is you see, that is why there are certain things chiefs are not allowed to do. You get me? You can't find a chief going to the market to go and be buying things. No, you can't find a chief, you know, like there are things that 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 chiefs are not allowed to do. And the 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 the, the critical part is that when a chief sits, he has a subject seated around him. Okay? He has a subject seated around him. And it is not for nothing that when when, when politicians go to events like this. They don't just go straight to sit down. They would want to go around and greet and shake hands with these chiefs. Consistently over the last eight years under President Ekufuado, okay, we have had this institution, this revered institution, this respected institution, bastardized. This institution disrespected. This institution denigrated. I am for a walk from Hanum and open woman. I'm in your more casa. Crap was an amaba is in San Samoso. They are the ones I'm addressing this morning that the National House of Chiefs must raise concerns about the level of, of, of impunity that is shown them by President Ekufuadu and his government. This is not the first time, and I'm sure that you have seen that video circulating. Of President Ekufuado go uh, in in OT region going to greet a chief and insists that the chief gets up gets up to greet him or to shake hands with him. Look, I want to tell every chief in this country: if the National House of Chiefs or the Regional House of Chiefs or the the will not rise up, they must ensure that that institution that has always been there. That they themselves came to meet the, the, the sanctity of that institution must be protected, must be safeguarded. I am I'm 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 really you see, as he's doing it like that, small, 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 mm -hmm. he will get to my hometown chief. So I must make sure that I raise the alarm now before he gets to my hometown chief and comes to order my hometown chief to get up and greet him. The presidency. And our chief tenancy institution, which one came first? Does the president understand the meaning of, of who a chief is? And, and, and you see, Sana, it is one of the institutions in this country that has been given constitutional backing in Article 270 of our 1992 constitution. And so it is not just any institution that you can just... And, and you see, when you even look at the 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 uh, uh, issues of of chieftaincy, uh, issues of chieftaincy, or disputes that arise as a result of 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 our is, uh, is, uh, the, the chieftaincy institution, they don't just take the matter straight to court. The chief, the 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 the, 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 the traditional councils, the regional house of chiefs, must deal with the matter. The national house of chiefs must deal with the matter even before it gets to the supreme court. 
That is the level of protection and, and, and respect our constitution has given to the chieftaincy institution in this country. This is not the first time the president is doing that. We have seen how his condescending, nonchalant attitude has been displayed all over. I mean, I, you, you have seen a couple of, 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 of his videos when he attends functions. Sometimes he orders chiefs about us. What, what, what the heck? I mean, excuse my language. Who, who does the president think he is? You will come for eight, four years and go. That chief will continue to be there. It is not for nothing. And this morning, I want to call on the National House of Chiefs. Please, issue a statement. Or call on the president to stop that level of denigration that he's visiting on such a, a, a revered institution such as our institution in this country. Because, you know, because, but of course, I haven't seen, you know, when I was watching that, I just couldn't watch that video. And, and you, you look at, look at his, his, his gestures and his posture. You know, such an arrogant leader we have visited on ourselves. What, what, what's all this? I didn't come for that one today, so I'll just uh, proceed to look at the... Okay, so since you've raised it, uh, David. Yes. I, I'm sure you've also seen the video. Yes, w I have. You agree with Peter? Very much so, but um, thank you for having me and good mm. morning once again. Um, I'm surprised that Peter's outburst because when when you were speaking with Tamaklo, mm. he signaled that you tell Tamaklo to take it easy. 